So, it turns out Mini Lad is officially back. Yay. How many times do we have to teach you this lesson, old man? You want my penis? <laughs> Hello everyone, TJV here, and yes, Mini Lad is officially back. Apparently he's going to be live streaming today as of Monday, January 30th of 2023. And um, other pieces of information we learned, again, I'm just going to keep this short, I'm just going to rattle them off. Apparently he moved from his Texas apartment back to Cali. He used to have a home in Cali and a home in Oregon, I believe, which were million dollar properties, I believe, they were pretty expensive properties, which he then sold and probably been living off the money from when he's made on YouTube and sponsors and deals and all this other stuff. He had a Ferrari and sold that probably. Lived in this Texas apartment, which again, don't know how much money it was, but he probably is doing just fine. He probably got a job at some point while he was taking his breaks because he probably got bored. I mean, the breaks he took from YouTube were only five or six months at a time. People want to sit here and say that like he took a long break and he, he got better and all this other stuff, but he went through years of lying and covering up this deep dark secret of him sending photos and receiving photos from minors and he did this for years and then he takes a five six month break here and there and now he's all good he got therapy so he's happy i'm sorry but no he uploaded the apology video when the allegations were coming out and he actually tried to keep going and not address the allegations at all but let's just skip to the apology video because that's when he first took a break then he took six months and then went to his craig thompson channel and started uploading Mr. Beast style videos. And then that wasn't really working out that well. And he decided to return to his main channel after a one month break from his Craig Thompson channel. And started uploading mini lad videos and all this other stuff for about 10 months. He made a, another channel called Good News Everyone. Then he took another five month break. Which leads to now, January of 2023. So the most amount of time he spent away from YouTube has only been six months, five months and one month at one point. But he's been spending more time in the last two years uploading videos than taking a break from YouTube. It probably doesn't feel like that at all because again, during the 10 months he came back to his main mini lad channel, which was the last time he came back, he was uploading videos slowly month after month after month, but it was never like an official break, like the five months at a time or six months at a time or whatever. So again, He's officially back, and he plans on live streaming today. He plans on doing meme streams every Saturday. It just kind of sucks, because, like, the only goal I really have is to spread around that Minilad doesn't deserve to be on the platform, and hopefully there's going to be enough people who maybe will even hop into his own chats and tell him, hey, you shouldn't be on YouTube. Again, I don't endorse or condone any sort of harassing and doxing and bullying of anybody at all, but again, somebody like Minilad, I believe, just should not be on the platform, and he should be told off that he should not be on the platform because obviously YouTube ain't gonna do nothing about him. The only thing YouTube did was demonetize his channel and he's still making money because he has a tip link in his live streams where he still gets donations. It ain't like he needs money anyway. He probably has a huge savings account and doesn't need money, but he still is getting money from fans that are more than likely under the age of 18 that are just loving him, telling him that they miss him and everything like that. Major, major supporters of Mini Lad. And that's not even the super bad part. The super bad part is that he has such cringy and over the top laughing and looking at memes and playing weird games and having a giant giraffe and a bowling pin as a son. I mean, that seems like the type of content creator that attracts kids to watch their videos anyways, like younger a younger audience, I should say. And I don't think him saying a few cuss words is going to stop kids from watching him at all. So, again, the more I can spread around the word that Mini Lad's on the platform, but he should not be, and he's a bad person, and he did this, this, and that. Again, just trying to spread around things that he did truthfully do, um, I think the better the world will be. So... That's what I'm going to continue to do. Thank you guys for commenting information for me and supporting me throughout this, but I know there are comments that I got that are telling me just to leave them alone and drop it and all this other stuff, which again, I won't until Mini Lad's officially done with the platform, but it seems like this is something he wants to do forever, so it's going to be a long, long time. But yeah, I don't know if I'm going to live stream when he live streams at all, maybe sometimes, but... <sighs> I'm not trying to send people to go and hate on him and, like, get in trouble by any means. But 
definitely people who want to go tell him, hey, you shouldn't be on the platform. You should address the things that you did publicly a lot better than what you did. Try to get him to the point where, like, his mind goes back to that and be like, oh, yeah, I did screw up. I shouldn't be on YouTube. I mean, that's sort of probably the way to go. But, again, I don't know. I think just that general backlash, general commentary channels making videos about it will uh, serve the situation better. So if you're a commentary channel watching this at all, feel free to make a video about Mini Lad. I completely condone that. And to everyone else, please be respectful and don't try to dox or harass or get yourself in any sort of trouble in this. Even though there is clearly an enemy and somebody who did something wrong here, uh, make sure to hold yourself in high regard and follow the rules. Thank you guys for watching the video, and um, yeah, expect more memes from me because I'm going to make fun of Mini Lad returning um, for a while. Again, not trying to bully, just trying to make fun of the situation while we have to talk about this horrible person. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys all next time. Peace. Oh, and one more thing. Join the Discord, please. That'd be great. See ya.